Daily Words of God Everything of this world swiftly changes with the Almighty's thoughts and beneath His eyes. Things mankind has never heard of suddenly arrive, whereas things that mankind has long possessed unknowingly slip away. No one can fathom the Almighty's whereabouts, much less can anyone sense the transcendence and greatness of the Almighty's life force. He is transcendent in that He can perceive what humans cannot. He is great in that He is the one who is forsaken by mankind and yet saves mankind. He knows the meaning of life and death, and more than that, He knows the laws of existence that mankind, who are created, should follow. He is the foundation of human existence, and He is the Redeemer who resurrects mankind again. He weighs down happy hearts with sorrow and lifts up sorrowful hearts with happiness all for the sake of His work and for the sake of His plan. Humanity, having strayed from the Almighty's provision of life, is ignorant of the purpose of existence, but fears death nonetheless. They are without help or support, yet still reluctant to close their eyes and they steel themselves to drag out an ignoble existence in this world, sacks of flesh with no sense of their own souls. You live in this way, without hope, as do others, without aim. Only the Holy One of legend will save the people who, moaning in the midst of their suffering, long desperately for His arrival. So far, such belief has not been realized in those who lack consciousness. Nevertheless, the people still yearn for it so. The Almighty has mercy on these people who have suffered deeply. At the same time, He is fed up with these people who lack consciousness as he has had to wait too long for an answer from humanity. He wishes to seek, to seek your heart and your spirit, to bring you water and food, and to awaken you, that you may no longer be thirsty and hungry. When you are weary, and when you begin to feel something of the bleak desolation of this world, do not be lost, do not cry. Almighty God, the Watcher, will embrace your arrival at any time. He is keeping watch by your side, waiting for you to turn back around. He is waiting for the day you suddenly recover your memory, when you realize that you came from God, that at some unknown time, you lost your direction. At some unknown time, you lost consciousness on the road. And at some unknown time, acquired a father. When you realize, furthermore, that the Almighty has always been keeping watch, waiting there a very, very long time for your return, he has been watching with desperate longing, waiting for a response without an answer. His watching and waiting are beyond any price, and they are for the sake of the human heart and the human spirit. Perhaps this watching and waiting are indefinite, and perhaps they are at an end but you should know exactly where your heart and your spirit are right now.